It's mind-blowing to think that Fallout 76 came out five years ago. I was a junior in high school when this game came out, and I remember playing it the first time and being massively let down. You know, the game launched with so many bugs. There was not enough story content. There was no NPCs. The game was just boring. And I would say overall progression was pretty bad. Now it's 2024, it's been five years, and the game has shaped up differently. I just revisited the game not that long ago, and I've been playing the game recently, and I've been actually having a lot of enjoyment with this game. I think it is worth a second try. I know that it's been a pretty mixed opinion for quite a while that the game gets a lot of bugs, there's not enough content being produced, and you know, all those arguments are valid and i agree fallout 76 should have been something else i think it could have been great as a story driven game instead of an online spin-off the thing is they could have just implemented multiplayer like three players could join another person's world and help them with quests i think that would have worked perfectly but even then, Fallout 76 isn't the worst game on the market right now. Don't get me wrong, the game still has a crap ton of issues. I've been running into tons of bugs and tons of issues. And even then, the story is still a mixed bag for me. But honestly, I've been having quite a bit of an enjoyment with it. I restarted my character um, and I just went through the game as a new player just to see if anything changed massively. I want to steer this video in a direction where we can have a discussion and maybe get you guys to hop back on Fallout 76. I know there's a bunch of players that quit after launch and I know there's a lot of people that want to revisit Fallout 76 and give it a second try and if this video comes across for you and if you're one of those people that fall into those camps then why not give the game a second try i think a lot of people will agree with me that fallout really hasn't aged well from fallout 1 to fallout even 3 4 new vegas but when it comes to fallout 76 i would really say that they stepped up their visuals for this game honestly when the game first came out i think i was really blinded by the issues that i forgot to take in how beautiful the atmosphere is it feels good walking down the broken, run-down streets of Appalachia. Now, don't get me wrong, I don't think Fallout 76 is a visual masterpiece, but I definitely do think it is the best-looking Fallout game to date. When it comes to the gameplay, it is still the same, nothing major has changed, building is nice, it was a jump from Fallout 4, and it's freaking cool that I can build my own camp. And what you can build is actually your imagination, and you can't be limited. Nah, I'm just playing. Because Bethesda hides all the cool stuff behind the Atomic Shop, and don't get me wrong, you can earn atoms, but it's so slow and the progression really halts, and I hate that in games, especially live service games. Now, I understand understand that Bethesda does this because they need to fuel development costs. That's what's putting money into the developers' pockets. I am very much aware of that and I am complaining. I am very much aware of that. And when it comes to the main story of the game, I have a hard time getting into it because I know the outcome for the end game. But I do love learning the lore of all the factions. I will say the story, it's interesting, but it's something I want to give more time. I will say for now, it's very intriguing. But if you're someone who hasn't played Fallout 76 since launch, or even since the major haul with wastelanders then i definitely do think the game is worth trying again and giving it a second chance there's so much new content to consume i would say overall i've been having a lot of fun with fallout 76 and i'm glad that i gave it a second chance but don't get me wrong it still has a fair share of issues and i know it's hard to get back into something once you had a bad impression but i truly believe fallout 76 deserves a second chance other than that, guys, I'm going to wrap up this video. I hope you guys definitely did enjoy, and I would really appreciate if you guys could drop me a like, subscribe if you guys are new. I really do appreciate your time, and with that being said, I'm going to wrap up this video. Have a great day, or have a great night whenever you're watching this video, and I hope you guys have a beautiful rest of your week.